Welcome back to this episode of 5 Minute Fly Tying. Let's jump right into it. Oh, welcome back to another episode of 5 Minute Fly Tying. Today's contestant is young Liam Sullivan. The rules are simple. You have five minutes to tie a fly with materials that you've never seen before. Let's see if young Liam can tie that fly. Good afternoon, America. It's young Liam here for another episode of Five Minute Fly Tying. Here I've got uh, one, of, one of Josh McQueen's patterns here. It looks, it looks like he dedicated this to Danny DeVito, but I really don't, I think this is trash. This is just dumpster trash right here. Uh, I know I can do something a little bit better than that. So here today we've got five minutes to tie a fly with whatever materials that he ended up picking for me. So here we go. You gotta sit down. What are you today, so, you know, I'm going to probably dedicate this fly to Josh McQueen just because his was such trash, and uh, I know that I, I can probably beat him with this one. <laughs> Let's do it one. Even though he had the e socks, whatever, butter, predator, whatever he said, I don't know what he said, but uh, I'm just going to kind of make one up here myself, maybe uh, put a little bit. You know what? I'm going to start out with some of uh, this uh, hair, I guess. I don't know. So, I've got a streamer hook 220 by Di 2200 by Daiichi. So just gonna, you, you know, I've been tying for one year, so I'm, I'm brand new to this, and I actually hadn't even started. I just started the other, I think, like two months ago. My inspiration for this fly is just beating Josh McQueen. That's pretty much all it is here, and I'm trying to find this thread. <laughs> you know what? Because he has, since day one, I mean, he never put me, he couldn't put me on a steelhead, and I just... <laughs> So you're choosing not to let it I'm just not using anything right now. I'm just going, I can't find the bobbin, so. <laughs> My feather fell, and I also don't have anything to tie this with. Where is it? Maybe 10, if you're lucky. If you really got it going on. Uh, my favorite fish to fly for, uh, the flying fish. <laughs> I'm gonna put a little flash on the front there. You know what? Uh, I, you know what? I'm all about just just going with the flow, letting letting everything else take you. I, I really don't have any tools that I'm using right now. I'm just kind of using my hands because I want to, and it's a little bit quicker. I like this little bit of this little bit of tiger in here. So what is this fly? Whew, you know what? <laughs> it kind of looks like a big muskrat to me with a little bit of flash in it. Looks like he just went to a little bit of a party. I don't know. I'm just going to resin this bad boy up and we'll, we'll let her go. You actually have two minutes. Left. Two minutes? Yeah, you, gotta keep, you have to tie for the duration of five minutes. He's gonna look for oh, I'm tying. What else we got in here? In the fly time world, I've always been a big fan of Pat Cohen and his uh, his uh, hair bugs. You know who else? Pat Kelly. Pat Kelly's a great tire, especially of uh, bucktail flies and everything like that. I'm slowly learning that that one of our own, also Justin Christofferson, is a pretty good tire, and uh, I'm, I'm looking forward to learning a little bit more from them down the way. What's your favorite fairground? Uh, whew, that's tough. I like those big turkey legs that you can just carry around and, and really just hammer down on the whole day. Um, can't get, can't get, can't go wrong with that. I mean, you got a snack for the whole day. You might get a little greasy, but but you'll have a good time. That's for sure. So what material are you adding now? So I'm adding a little bit of uh, UV polar chenille uh, and the olive, just to add a little bit on the top there. Uh, it's really sticking. It, it's really holding together nice. So I, I love how this is, this fly is turning out. You know, 
you can't say anyone could do this better than I could right now, but uh, we're letting it hold there. You have one minute remaining. Talk to the viewers at home. So to the viewers at home, uh, you may, it may seem like I'm just kind of tying this all with my hand and just doing it kind of free-handed here, which I am. I mean, and I'm an artist, so that's why I really do it that way. Uh, I mean, if, if you'd like to do it the traditional way, you can, but I mean, that's not really me. So if you're five minutes, if you got five minutes and you've got a bunch of material, just go ahead and toss it together and use a little use a little UV nano light to... Your hands are shaking. My hands are good. My hands are good. I'm getting a little nervous here. It's getting down. We're going to brush it up here a little bit, straighten it out. 15 seconds remaining. Hurry up! <laughs> Five seconds remaining. Just trimming it up. Wow, good job, Liam. Thank you. So uh, this is my fly here. We call it the Turd Burger 9000. Um, got a little hint of lavender in there, some other spices and things that, that really help attract fish. So we got bass, pike, musky, hybrid stripers. Um, so that's it. That's my fly there. And I challenge Justin Christofferson here for, for the next segment of five minute fly tying. So make sure you comment, subscribe, and like. Young Liam out. If you like this video, hit subscribe. It helps out a lot. And check out these videos. We think you might like them too.